Hello and welcome to my Played Up Safe Slots mod tutorial. I just want to preface this video by saying I'm not affiliated with the Yogscast team and modding is currently unsupported, so be careful what you download. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to download the mod for both Bepinex and Melon Loader. And if you don't know which is right for you, I'd personally go for Bepinex as there are currently more mods available for it. Alright, so to start off, we want to go to the link in the description copy paste that and then once we're here we want to go and download bepinex with this direct download all right now we want to go and drag this to our desktop and now we want to go to our plate up folder which is found in steam steam apps common plate up and then plate up again we want to go ahead and drag the zip file from the desktop into the plate up folder right here. And then we want to right click WinRAR extract here. If you don't have WinRAR, then just right click it, click extract all. All right. So now you can go ahead and delete the zip file. Now we want to start up the game once. Just to initialize all the mod folders needed for all the mods to work. Once it's started up, you can just Alt F4. All right, now we want to go to Bepinex, Plugins, and now we want to go back to the website. Now that we're here, scroll back up, go to Releases, which you'll find right here, Save System Mod, version 1.2.0. Just download the latest version. Now we want to scroll down all the way to the bottom to Assets, and download Safe System Bepinex.dll. Once that's downloaded, click keep, go back to your desktop, and drag it into your plugins folder. Just grab this, drop it right in. And now, go back to plate up, right here, and start up your game. Alright, now onto Melon Loader. So, you want to go to the link in the description, copy paste it in your browser, you want to go to Safe System version 1.2.0, scroll all the way down, make sure to download Safe System underscore melon dot dll. And now we want to download Melon Loader. So to do that, just search up Melon Loader, and it's the first link all the way at the top. And now we want to go to Releases, and then click Melon Loader dot Installer dot exe. Also, make sure to click Keep. And then you want to run melonloader.installer.exe. Select plate up. Just go to plate up folder. Then to plate up.exe. Make sure it's not a shortcut. And then we just want to click install. Melon loader is super easy to uninstall, so don't be scared. And then now we can see there's a melon loader folder in here. Next up, drag the DLL onto your desktop or just into the mods folder, which you will find in the plate up folder. And now there should be a newly created folder called mods. Just drag the DLL into there. And now you should be able to start it up. If you're having an issue, just go to the comments. I'll be sure to reply. Begin single player start. And now you should see in the options menu right here there's a load save rename delete and if you have a recover save right here all you gotta do to save it is click options press to save enter the save name and now you gotta click enter and I should say run already saved and then, let's just say for example, you go into it, and then somehow, some way, you lose. And now, you'll see the recover save is gone, but if we go into escape options, press to load, it'll say selection already loaded, and then to fix that we just go into tutorial. And then once you leave the tutorial, the recover save should be here. 
Yep. And this should be the same exact map. Another way to use it, if you already have a save ongoing and you want to keep it, then just go ahead and create a new save. If you properly saved it in this menu, then you should, let's say you create another one, if you start it up, when you're done with the run, just click quit game. It'll automatically save it. And now when you start up the game again, you will see the recover save in the HQ. And now, for example, you can save this run as a separate run by pressing the save. Now just name it something like solo run or whatever you want to name it. And now you'll see we have solo run and tutorial two runs that you can load whenever you want so you can load this and and now you can see it's the old run and we c when we quit game we can just abandon so that was our tutorial run We can go to options, solo run, load that, and then when you go into tutorial, there will be a recover save right here, and you can just start up your run again. Thank you so much for watching, and have fun with your new save slots. That's pretty good.